Hi, I'm Tony. Welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video about how to change a visor and a sun visor on a Shark Squall 2.2, and it also applies to a Shark Squall 2, a Shark Squall, a D Squall, and a D Squall 2. So it's a lot of helmets all covered by one video. Right, as I said, this uh, video is going to cover quite a few helmets, but essentially they might look slightly different in the way the visor mounts, but it's all the same. Now, we start by lifting the visor to get it in the raised position. There is a bit of a knack to getting this right. In the early days of these squalls, there were a fairly large number of people who broke their visors by getting this a bit wrong. So what sharks say to do is to make sure you aren't angling this visor here too much away from the angle of the plate. So you don't want to be pushing it towards the helmet because that also creates more friction here. You don't want to be levering it away from the shell either. You want to try and keep it just slightly off the shell, but not too far. And then it's just a case of gripping the visor and pulling. So we just pull from there and that comes out of there. It really is that easy. It's just about getting that angle right and making sure you're pulling it straight. So the same again, we're slightly proud of that shell, pull and we're clear. Same when we put it back in, just keep it nice and straight. These lugs on here need to go back underneath this mounting ring here. You'll see under there that there's the central part of that plate. So we just offer that up, keep it nice and straight and push till we hear that click. Same on the other side, offer these lugs into here and push. Give the visor a couple of lifts and lowers and that's fine. Now to the sun visor. Thankfully on this one, it's a bit simpler than it is on many sharks. So we start with the sun visor fully lowered and it's just a case of getting hold of each side and pulling it free of the guides that are in there. So just pull it there, rotate the helmet, pull here and then just lower it to get it free of the rim. When you come to put it back in, these lugs on the side just offer into guide runners that sit between the shell and the EPS. Now, sometimes they just ride up into the helmet a little bit and a quick shake should bring them back down, but they've stayed lowered here, thankfully. So we'll just get those lugs, offer them into the guide runner there and push till we hear the click. So that's home, rotate, do the same on this side, into the guide runner, push till we hear that click. Make sure it's under the rim there. Check by operating the switch a couple of times. Everything's fine on that. So that is how you replace the main visor and the sun visor on a Shark Squall 2.2, a Shark Squall 2, a Squall Original, a D Squall, and a D Squall 2. Thanks for watching.